Hello everyone, Gwen here. Welcome back to Stardew. Of course, first things first, we check the TV. So it's going to be sunny tomorrow. Not so good. And neutral. Okay. And did we miss anything? No, we already know how to do stir fry, so that's okay. Oh, oh. I got a dog. Did I ask for a dog? I can't remember. Hello, Gwen. Hi, Marnie. You see this dog here? Yep. Bark, bark. <laughs> it's kind of cute. Wish I had a cho choice of color, but that's okay. I found it sitting outside the entrance to your farm. I think it's a stray. Poor thing. I'm guessing down there by her place. Hey, it seems like to like this place. Uh, do you think this farm could use a good dog? Yeah, sure. We'll adopt it. Um, what do we want to name you? So, if we're going with games for this, how do I want to name you? Um... Let's name you Kendall. Hi, Kendall. Well, Kendall, you'll be a good pooch now, okay? Yay, we have Kendall. Or we call him Ken. Yeah. Yay. Oh, we got stuff. Come on, parsnip. Come on, gold quality. Just got silver. Not really good. Oh. And we got silver out of that. That's not good. Least we got potatoes. Um, I guess we'll sell off the parsnips. We can sell off most of the potatoes. We do need one, though. We do need one. Because we need one for the community center. So that's all we really need for that. Nobody really cares for potatoes as they're like, so that's why I'm not like too worried about it. Nope, don't do that. Do do do. Let's water everything that we need to. At least we got some stuff. We got some stuff to sell off. Though it is kind of sad that we don't have um uh uh any gold any more gold parsnips it is one of the things unless you have the ability to get fertilizer it's hard to get in your first um spring i will be though hopefully once i do have the ability to do fertilizer i will be doing that so your dog would normally be up here but they can wander around all over your property wherever they wish to go i mean you got a giant farm Though most of it is kind of trees and rocks. So, and grass. Alright. Um, I think I'm going to go fishing today. I can't go see anything about that. So, where do we want to go fishing? Um, let's go down here into the forest. We'll go down there for the whole fishing thing. So we can try getting some river fish. Because what we need left for the lake is, I think, a sturgeon. And I kind of can't catch that right now. I am uh, too tiny of a fisher for that. And since we're not planning on going for any of the mining things as of right now. Yeah. So, oh, green algae. Not the most useful thing in the world. We'll just keep fishing until either I have no energy or, uh, we can get rid of the trash. Some of this stuff is useful eventually, but as I said, since we don't have a recycling machine, it's not the most exciting thing in the world. I had the broken glasses there so we can make some refined quartz eventually. Um, but yeah, that's down the road. More green algae. I'm just looking for some, just some fish. Like, you know, maybe a sunfish or something. Catfish. Just getting green algae. I mean, I guess it does give me some experience for it, but I would like some actual fish. So I can take it to the community center. Eventually. Come on. Yay, we got a sunfish. Yes. So, two things to go to the community center. Woot. 
we're just going to have green algae to sell today. Do, do, do. So, can we get anything? Hmm, what shall we get? Look at all those pretty butterflies. They're so pretty. They're just wandering around. It's like, I like this one over here. This little pink on it. That's so cool. Oh, we got a sunfish we can keep for ourselves to to sell off. Oh, where are you guys going? You're leaving. They're leaving us. You are not a sunfish. You're something else. I don't know what you are, but a sunfish you are not. Your pattern is different. Um, if you fish enough, you'll start learning their patterns. So you'll get to the point of where you can recognize a fish just by their patterns. What did I catch? I got a chip. Uh, I'm out of room. <laughs> okay, I guess this way to the community center to drop off those two things, and then we'll just go fish over there by um, up that way. Do to do. Just gonna head up this way. Oh hi, Haley. Only thing I like about this town is the beach. You just like the beach. Okay. Um, maybe she doesn't like small towns? Maybe? I mean, it's not for everyone. Some people like the peace and quiet, but some people don't. Drives them absolutely bonkers. Okay, so we got some river fish. So let's go ahead and put that in there. And then we need to go over to the other one. To go and put the potato in. Because we got potatoes. Potatoes. Spring crops. Put it in there. So we just need, are waiting for the cauliflower to grow up and the green bean, which we'll probably get the green beans soon, which is a repeatable crop. So if you're looking for profits, it's one of the better ones to get. Um, there is a better spring crop, which you probably won't have right away in game. You get the seeds, uh, they're strawberries. You get the seeds during the, I believe, the egg festival. And, um, they're really good. But you don't get that until more towards the end of the month of spring. Got another sunfish. Yeah, you can catch, this is, counts as a river too. So, we can use that. So we still have a chance to catch that catfish. A little bit, a little bit of a chance. Um, wish we could have an aquarium. I don't know how many of you guys have played Animal Crossing. But in that one, you could basically, in the museum, you could make uh, an aquarium with all the things that you've caught, which would be awesome. Because there's some stuff that you don't really, you can't get really otherwise, like your legendary fish, like the mutant carp, the legend, the glacier fish, um, uh, there's a couple others, I can't think of their names. Sniff, sniff. Ah, I sense you've been spending some time in the old community center. It's good to know someone's taking care of the place. You can recognize the scent off of me. Okay, that's a little creepy, Lewis. A little creepy. Remember to cover your mouth when you sneeze. Okay, that's a very doctory thing to say, Harvey. Very doctory. I can't even pick that up because I don't have the room. Ah, oh, I'll come back for you. Hopefully you'll be something more than just rocks or clay. Maybe it'll be something nice. Okay, let's sell off what we got, and then we'll go back out there. Grab that. So these worms can either hold nice goodies, like artifacts, or they can hold stuff like clay. Which, I mean, clay is good to have for, um, like, the silo and a few other things. But clay, for the most part, isn't really important. But, oh well. We got ourselves some more stuff to sell off. Some stuff to put in the chest. Let's put that in there. Put that in there. So we got all that. Uh, I guess since we're up here, why don't we go ahead and start taking out some more of these trees. Because we need to get 300 wood so we can open up the other area. Which we'll eventually need to either marry somebody in the game or we'll need it for... Uh, just so we have much easier access to the whole beach and we can get the um, the 
item, the forgeable items that are on the, the beach. I'm almost dead. Uh, Scything won't kill me. In case you didn't know, Scythe, using your Scythe or your sword, costs no energy. So you can use that all day long. That's why if you'll see me, I'll have it over one of those things. So if you do accidentally hit it, you won't be causing, uh, you won't be wasting energy needlessly. Well, uh, not much to do today, so let's go ahead and go to, oh, the high candle. I just got into my house. Okay, I guess he wants to watch TV because it looks like he just pushed the, is like has his neat nose against the TV. I can make some stone fences. I can make a mayonnaise machine, and I can make a sprinkler. Mayonnaise machine not important at the moment, but eventually it will be. Let's see, I can make some bait, which is cool. All the stuff. Oh, am I gonna have enough? I think I might have enough. Let's get out of this. Look, I might have enough for the backpack upgrade. Yes, I do! And I have extra! So I can buy myself some more parsnips. Beautiful sunny day tomorrow. Good humor today. Wolves from crows sounds like you need a scarecrow. Placing a scarecrow on your farm deters crows from a pretty good distance. Make sure you protect your valuable crops. One more thing. Need a bigger backpack to hold all your stuff? Check your local general store. Oh yes, that's what we're doing. We're going to the general store. I lost my favorite axe. If you find it, please return ASAP. I'm having a tough time without it. There's 250 chi in for whoever finds the thing. Robin. Good thing I know exactly where to look for that. Okay. For now, let's water all the crops. Then we'll go find the axe. Then we'll go up to the store. Then we'll go buy, uh, go stop by Robin. Go give her axe. Get some more money come back, plant the stuff, and then depending on how much energy I have at that time, maybe go do some fishing or chop down some more trees. We'll see how that goes. We shall see. We shall see. And the cart's not open today because the cart's only open on um, Friday and Sundays, which you get all kinds of goodies for. As you've seen, we got in the puffer fish, which is one of the harder fishes to find just because you only have a four hour window a day in summer and if you're taking care of everything yourself it's kinda difficult to do look at Kendall, he's like I'm going over here and I'm gonna go run around it's a nice big yard for him to play in, there's lots of grass, lots of things to smell oh, I didn't mean to water you dog, but eh dogs love water like every time like I've ever seen a video with a dog and they're playing in the water they are so happy it's like dogs just love water for some reason they just do they're so happy about it but then again dogs are pretty much happy about everything so <laughs> kinda can't really say too much about that alright maybe we'll find some onions while we're down here too um you can get spring onions down this way ooh hey Horseradish. We'll keep that. So that'll be useful. Oh, yep. There is a spring onion. Spring onions aren't really used for anything other than just selling it. There's the axe. You found the lost axe. Better return it to Robin. We'll keep the horseradish because there's a person who really loves horseradish. And once we get that person unlocked, we'll try to be friends with them. And the easiest way, is, of course, is horseradish. So, I know you probably be tempted to sell off your horseradishes, but if you're attempting to be friends with this character, then it'd probably be easier just to have lots of horseradishes, stick them all in the chest, uh, um, and then just give it to them. Ooh, we got an anchovy. Hi, Penny. We're lucky to have a small town. Uh, library in town, yep. Okay, two Pierre's first since that's closest. There's a thing here, I'm just curious. Two chub. Not right now. I'm going to buy it. Yes! The goodness of a pack. Look! We have an extra row! I'm so happy. Now let's get some more parsnips. Because we need parsnips. Do we need anything else? I don't think we really need too much right now. Um, oh yeah, we need to also start saving up. 
is we need pomegranates and we need apples. So we need to grab those soon. Those will probably be some of those other things. We'll eventually need oranges as well for things. So time, we're going to be probably starting to save up for some more um, upgrades either to our tools or we'll start saving things for uh, or uh, for those saplings because we really need the saplings because we need to have them because they take a month to grow so yeah, it takes 28 days uh, nope, I gotta go around here you go Robin you found my axe what a relief I almost chopped my toe off using the other one I was using thank you Here's, I heard that Louis showed you around the community center it'd be great if you could fix the place up it used to be a really nice building. Yay, we have the money. Woot, thank you, Robin. So that also builds friendship points with her as well. So if you get any quests like that with asking them to bring you something, do it because it does give you more friendship bonuses. Hello. Would you like an anchovy? A gift, how nice. Uh, he's not super happy about it, but that's okay. I'm kind of tempted to go in there. Um... I guess I can go a little bit in there since I'm here already. Maybe we can kill some more slimes. And we actually have room now. Um, you can hoe this ground. You can find artifacts. You can find cave carrots. Bugs! Nope, get away from me. Get away from me, insects. You are very annoying. Why are there so many bugs? they hate me today? I forget. Wasn't it neutral? I think it was neutral, wasn't it? Um, so it's a good thing to save your bug meat because what you can do with that um, is use it for uh, bait, which you can either use in your crab pots or put on your pole when you get a better uh, fishing pole. So... See, now we can have so much stuff in our inventory and not have to worry about it. Oh dear. It's a slime room. You get these from time to time um, where a room gets infested with with uh, monsters. Most of the time it's slimes. So you have to basically, if you want to continue down, you got to go and kill everything that's in it including these bugs that wish to be here. I don't like those bugs because they get very hard to kill them all. So, at least by doing this we'll get the one uh, thing done with killing the ten slimes. We'll have that done. And also we'll work on getting, oh, we'll get all their goodies, like that amethyst. Go away. Actually, I should, you know, be giving that to Abigail because she loves Amethyst. And so if we want to start getting her happy, kind of have to do that. So, we got some coal. Go away, slime. Looks like they're nice enough to give us a, a staircase. And some of them, they don't give staircases. I don't think it was supposed to be there. Anything of interest? Not really. Let's head down. They must not like me today because they're like so bad. Have I not finished the. Yes. I gotta enter the guild. What level? I'm on 13, so I need to go down two more levels. Oh. Is he a rock or is it just because I'm. Let's get some copper while I'm here. And there's a topaz down there. Ugh. Go away. Go away. Oh, and a druggie on top of that. Go away. This is why they get dangerous because they just go right, like, right through you. And it's hard to hit them. 
Because they come at it like such angles. Okay, I gotta go. I gotta go. I'm gonna die. No. 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 Run away. Oh. <sighs> Barely survived that one. I didn't want to lose everything. I'm okay. Nothing will attack me in the real world. Or outside the mines. Hello. I'm here. Yeah, you can buy all kinds of things. You can buy wooden blade. Which I'm kind of tempted for, but not the biggest need right now. So this kind of shows you your stuff. Um, every time you finish one of these things off, like you have 18 out of 1,000 slimes, if you finish that off, they will give you a special prize. As you can see, there are several things to end up killing. And you can keep going down in the mines. They'll just keep respawning. So, um, Of course, each level will be different depending on whatever it is. Let's see. Let's oh, I'm at hit crafting. Let's go ahead and make some bait so we can get that into bait. Um, bug meat's not really used for much other than bait in the in the game. Which, like I said, is either could be useful for fishing or your crab pots. Um, it's the only way to get your crab pots to do anything is with bait. I almost died there. That was kind of scary. Because what happens is you lose a lot of your items. Um, it, and then you don't get them away and so you can lose a lot of valuable things and you may not be able to get them back oh yeah they haven't done that one yet I'm debating on whether I want to do the mushrooms oh hi Gandalf or if I want to do the fruit I'm not sure yet I've not gotten that far okay let's sell that off um, we can sell the cherry uh, we'll sell off that. A lot of this stuff we can kind of keep for now. Put that in there, that in there, that in there, that, that. Um, I'll keep the amethyst on me so I can go and, um, let's organize everything. Just so that way I can, uh, have a chance to uh, make Abigail happy with me. Let's put this up here so I know next time I see Abigail to give her that because she loves Amethyst. Oh, how did I miss these guys from not watering them? I don't know. Very weird. I guess in the meantime, let's go ahead and chop down some more trees. That did not go as well as I had planned. I had hoped to get to, you know, level 15, but those bugs had other plans. They wanted to be much more meaner than they needed to be. But that's okay. That's okay. Do -do -do. Let's go ahead and put this stuff away. We still have made quite a bit of progress today. I mean, it's not a super lot, but we have made some. Now we can keep the tulip on us. For when we get to that, uh, yeah, because we can give her more stuff. Most people are like not happy with us, but that's okay. All right, uh, it's been an exciting day. Lots of cool stuff have happened. We got our backpack, so now that we have our nice, wonderful 24 slots, we can do so much with all of this. So that's so cool. Well. Um, if you have any comments about um, what you would like to see me do in the future, any, either whether it be challenges or just uh, see in the game of what you want, or if, if you want uh, me to do more fishing, more mining, more building, just let me know in the comments below. And if you have any um, tips on finishing the community center faster, let me know as well. I'd be it would be lovely to hear uh, to hear anything from you about that. Uh, if you liked the video, please do leave a like on it. And if you want to uh, see more content like this, feel free to subscribe. And thank you all for watching, and have a wonderful and blessed day. Bye!